I, after I upload all these videos, dude, it's fucking crazy, man. Man. Again, I'm sorry, guys. I love, I love everybody. I keep getting stronger. I'm gonna have to go through, man. It's gonna, it's gonna hurt. I can already think of the worst possible thing. I have no choice. I'm gonna go through it, man. I have to, man. Because either... I mean, I've already saved the Lord. Listen. I trust the Lord, man. Even more. I'm already getting stronger, so certain things that would have bothered me don't even bother me anymore, man. I love every one of you, man. I'm so sorry. And yeah, I get annoyed and I say a cuss word and shit, but you're going to be going through shit even when you do meditate. I can see it in the eyes of every woke person. They're going through shit, but it doesn't mean they're not overall happy because they get happier, they get stronger. It's like where you are at overall, so like... You can be happy 24-7, but maybe not literally, but it doesn't matter. You can meditate even more. You'll be happy overall. So, yeah, you will be happier than the ones that are stuck in the Matrix. Like, maybe like a 0.5% chance that, that wouldn't happen. That's not going to happen, man. If they're in the Matrix, they're not going to be happy. I'm just going to say that right now. And if I'm wrong, and there's like, I don't know. If you have an MK Ultra victim and you're somehow able to distort their mind or the illusion is still strong enough to keep them in the Matrix where they're always happy, even then, well... You can, you can do anything, man, but, like, overall, the way everything is set up in this realm spectrum of where everybody is at in this world, it's not the case. All of you are not happy, man. That's so sad, man. Gosh, I love all of you, man. The more the negative frequencies get within me, the more love I have for all of you, man. I'm so sorry, dude. It sucks, man. And I'm gonna lose all this weight, man. Man, dude. Uh, well, not. my teeth are still white, and I haven't brushed them in one day, but because I brushed them so much, I'm gonna do a 10 minute brush, man. I have so much shit going on, but. Yeah. It's sad, man. <clears throat> again, again, man. Yeah, man. Like, John Lennon talks to Tom Snyder on the news and says, you know, we go out places, we can go wherever we want now that, now that the Beatles mania died down. We can go out to eat Yoko. He acts like he's in a relationship with Yoko Uno. Dude, Yoko Uno has sex with Hillary Clinton. Dude, it's all a game to them. They're all in, for, working for an agenda. It doesn't mean anything. It's all for the devil, man. So when John Lennon said to Tom Snyder, yeah, we go out to eat, we go out places. Dude, play it backwards. He says, no, no. And he's talking to Tom Snyder. No, we were there where it goes evil in the buttocks. Me and you, we were all on our back outside most nights. Most nights, they were, it was evil in the buttocks. It has nothing to do with gay people and the fact that you're gay. Like, I wouldn't even care. It was just the fact that you're gay and that you want to dress up like a woman. Go ahead. Like, I don't even care. It's not about the fact that I'm, you know... It's not the fact that I'm saying that, Oh, you can't be different and I'm enslaving you because, Oh, how dare you can't be different. No. If you want to be gay, dude, the guy, guy's not even going to send you to hell. That's too much on the surface, but, like, it's an agenda. It's meant to destroy you, man. LGBTQ, it's meant to get rid of your sperm count and destroy us, man. So, like, it's sad, man. Because all that, like, yeah, it's meant to destroy you, dude. Yeah, it is, man. So when they, it starts going over the line where they're purposely perpetuating this shit, where it's like they're gonna start, like you know, having parents like give their give their children like fucking hormone pills that are gonna fucking like make them more into a woman. That fucking kills them. That is fucking ruining them. That's so evil, dude. These people are so wicked. And if you meditate, you can handle it. The more you meditate, you'll be okay, and you'll be able to handle anything. But like they um, even the people who are gay, like when it starts involving demons and shit. That's, that's, that's some evil shit, and it's meant to destroy us, man. They're working for evil. It's not get us to be okay. They're trying to send us all to the lowest dimension, man. They don't want us to ascend up in heaven. Again, all because, all because Lucifer couldn't be like God. That's the reason why all this shit's going on. It gets, it gets more complex, but if Lucifer could have just been like, eh, I don't want to, I'm okay, but see, evil had to exist, man. I, I can understand where he's coming from, but still, it's the most selfish thing ever. Man. That's pretty some, that is some selfish shit, man. And God offered me all his power, I turned it down. Huh. So.
I don't even want that shit. At this point, I don't give a fuck that I'm the chosen one, that I'm like second from God. I don't give a fuck because <laughs> I didn't even ask for this shit. I didn't even want it. Dude, I came into this world thinking I was a normal ass person. Everybody in this world fucking knows who I am. Dude, right here in this backyard, right over here, I fucking bawled my eyes out and then at night time when I really got to grasping that everybody in this world that's prominent, even independent rappers, they all know who I am. Even before I knew them and most prominent, every prominent person has known who I was before I was born because I'm related to Ad the Adam and Eve family and I'm the chosen one, the last descendant in the sense I'm the chosen descendant to try to carry the light. They all fucking know who I am. Most of them aren't even fucking human, man. And uh, I cried, I bawled my eyes out because there's so many celebrities that I fantasized about, you know, because I talked to myself so much, fantasizing about having conversations with them and smoking weed with them and they all fucking hate me and want to kill me. Or they want me defeated. Again, Vince Stables, like, dude, they all fucking make fun of me and giggle about me, about how I'm going to be defeated. They all fucking don't like me. I had no control over this. Imagine being a normal person. Dude, nobody would be able to handle this. Well, I wouldn't say that. I mean, I'm sure if you start meditating. The point is how... It would, it would make you anxious as fuck. It would make you cry, dude. That's why they try to make me go insane. And just give up and join the devil and, you know, join... If I would have joined them, they would have been like, Ah, forget about it, man. You're with us now. You're going to be okay. And uh, we're not even going to go to hell.